I joke, but it's the truth. I was actually conceived, uh, most likely in the parking lot at the Bakersfield Drag Strip. I grew up in an era reading about the Don Perdomes, the Don Schumachers, Big Daddy Don Garlitz. It was the most amazing thing as a kid that looked up to these drag racers like they were everything. They were like astronauts to me. I drove for Don the Snake Perdome for nine years, almost a decade. I've been with Don Schumacher for over a decade. Don Schumacher, he's all business. He hires these people, he leaves them alone. He'll get in your, your stuff if you mess up, believe me. But he's very good at just hiring people and let them let them go at it and trying to put the best people together. Still a trip to say I drove for the snake. Don Perdome was very hands-on. Um, there was no baby in. If you didn't say anything, you were like, oh, whew. But if you didn't, he let you know it. He was very involved to the point where he could have tuned one. Don Schumacher's the same way. You gotta imagine back in the 70s, you raced on a Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and they had to figure out a way to get to the next race. So I always feel, I joke, but I, I really believe I was born 25 years too late. I think if I could have raced with Jungle Jim and the Snake and the Mongoose, I would have fit right in. I mean, I just, I envy that lifestyle back then. I'm sure it wasn't as glamorous as it, as it was caked up to be, but I, I would just, I would give anything to race every night of the week at a different track.